right, guys, welcome to this week's edition of One Gotta Go. You know how we do it. We give you four choices, and you let us know which one gotta go. Last week, Steve had Rocky Balboa opponents, and you guys voted that pretty much unanimous that Tommy Gunn <laughs> gotta go. Yeah. Who, voted, who voted off Apollo Green? One person <laughs> voted off Apollo well, One person. It was for my poll. <laughs> <laughs> one person. I'll find you. Get your people, Donald. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just let you know he's close. Uh oh. <laughs> We're gonna see him later. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. This week uh, we're gonna head into college comedy movies. So, kind of going like a little bit of like a fraternity theme here for college. Uh, we got Animal House, Back to School, Old School, and Van Wilder. I tried to give a little variety too over time, like seventies, eighties, <laughs> thick thing. So. Which one of these college comedies got to go? Don, I know this is in your wheelhouse, but. Yeah, it's not in my wheelhouse, but I can actually say I've seen three to four. Okay. Yeah. So the fourth one I haven't seen will automatically uh, vote it off for me because I don't know what it's about. And that will be back to school. Flip oh, desk. I actually was going to think Van Wilder. Flip a damn desk. <laughs> <laughs> back to school. I never even. Never even heard of it. Rodney Dangerfield. Great movie. <laughs> Great movie. Yeah. That, that's in my top 10 of all time right there. <laughs> For me, it's between old school and animal house. I'm going to go recency bias and I'm going to vote off animal house. Yeah. I, I had a feeling, man, you might think alike on this one. It's been a long time since I've seen it. I might have to go back and, and watch. Okay. The reason why I thought we were going to think alike, I didn't see Animal House till later. Uh -huh. Like, like it, I think it was like in college or like maybe even like right after. But Animal House is one of those movies, Jason, that you always talk about that gets hyped up and overhyped constantly. So it's like by the time you see yeah. it, like was it overhyped in your mind? And that's how I felt that it was kind of overhyped. Like, I can get that. Yeah. So it's like, not saying it's not a good you movie had, at all, because it is. I think, you know, for people, it still holds up, you know, and like some people that that's their college movie that they grew up on, you know, or their fraternity movie that they grew up on. So that that's what they're going to go to. But all of these, I could, I'd much rather watch over again than going back and watching Animal House. So Animal House can go for me. Same. Rewatchability. Yeah. Back mm -hmm. to school. One of my favorite movies. So I think I'd watch that first. <laughs> Out of all I'm a huge Ronnie Dangerfield fan. So it's yeah. like anything with him I'll watch over and over again. And that's that's probably that's up there. That that might be number two from favorite Ronnie Dangerfield movie. Mm -hmm. I, I gotta go Caddyshack, number one for Ronnie Dangerfield. Then Ladybugs. <laughs> Uh, Steve gave his response. Uh, Animal House and Old School are not going anywhere. They're classics. Van Wilder was okay, and Dangerfield is great in any role. Would have to kick off Van Wilder. I guess I can see why. I can get it. I, can yeah. see, I get not, it. Depends on your, I'm on your humor, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm a Ryan Reynolds guy, so I don't, I don't think he put anything up here. I'm not taking him off. Yeah. Same. Even though he's Ryan Reynolds and everything. <laughs> I enjoy everything. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and that, that could even be a one gotta go, like actors who play themselves and everything. <laughs> there you go. Michael B. Jordan. There you go. Right? He, he's definitely getting voted off. <laughs> All right, guys. There you have it. College comedies. Animal House, Back to School, Old School, and Van Wilder. Let us know in the polls this week which one gotta go.